Madame Sorceuse, Dr. Vincent Bonnari, le directeur du bureau d'éducation catholique, M. Gilbert Chen, le directeur du PSC, M. Maïs Wana Lechman, le chairperson du board de governors, M. Philippe Archen, M. Assomptin de la PS Congregation, le manager, M. Madeleine Va, le député directeur, M. Micheline Durat, le président de la PTA, M. Nadine Amadou, Members of the Executive Committee of the PTA, Members of the Board of Governors, Mr. Jimmy Arbon, UNESCO 2009 Jean Margeau, Parents, Colleagues of the Teaching and Non-Teaching Staff, Members of the Press, My dear Students, Ladies and Gentlemen. I am deeply honoured and delighted to welcome you all to this annual prize giving ceremony, which is an occasion to congratulate our dear prize winners and all those who have contributed to their commendable achievements. Thank you to you for all having gracefully honoured our invitation. My special thanks go to the Minister of Education and Human Resources, Dr. Honorable Vincent Bernard, who graciously accepted to be the guest of honor of this event. Indeed, I wish to thank Dr. Bernard for making our time to be in our midst today. We are highly honored by your presence and your support to the College. The Prize Giving Day is an annual event where the school community celebrates the students who have kept the flag of the college flying so high through their excellence and dedication in both curricular and co-curricular activities. Our students are assessed on a continuous basis to keep them on their toes. It is the average of the cumulative scores of a student for the entire academic year which determines her qualification for a prize. Bearing this in mind, many of our students have learned to devote more time to their studies. We are therefore here today to celebrate the winners of these prizes and salute the help and guidance provided by our staff and the parents of prize winners. Many of you have strived to do your best in order to partake in this ceremony. And I believe that this represents the true spirit of our school. The prize winners are a true representation of everything that we stand for here at BPS College. These hard-working, articulate young people are a credit to the school and an inspiration to us all. Although we know that participation is a key element in team sports, school events and life in general, winning is what motivates us to go beyond our limits and achieve our full potential. It is through such achievements that we are clearly able to see the skill, high expectation and commitment to the staff, students and parents at BPS College and these prize winners are great examples of what we hope for them, for our students. I wish to use this forum to congratulate all our students who have excelled. I urge you, my dear students, to continue and maintain this momentum. Your achievements are a palpable demonstration of a standard and good quality for which this college stands and is reputed. We continuously encourage our students to devote time and energy to their studies and extracurricular activities. Our school stresses on the importance of sports and co-curricular activities alongside academic work. We believe that the participation of our students in such diverse and rich activities helps to complement academic work of our students in such diverse and rich fields. 
I wish to salute the excellent performance of our students who are representing our country in the Indian Ocean Island Games in Seychelles. We are glad to know that Saha Silva was the first Mauritian athlete to win a gold medal. Deborah Wong also won a gold medal in table tennis and Kei Fukyun in badminton respectively. I would ask you that we could congratulate. Discipline is a desirable quality in any human being. As educationists, we do not only concentrate on academics, but we vigorously pursue discipline as an integral aspect of character molding of students. The college administration and staff have not relented in its efforts to command the good behavior of the disciplined ones. We will therefore like to use this opportunity to thank all parents for their known support and guidance provided to their daughters and wives. Together we are embarked on a journey to shape the bright futures of our young girls. I am a believer in hard work and against all odds. I am confident that we have the right vision and mission to provide the best education to all our students. The College has made noticeable progress and I am convinced that all of us present here are so infused by our achievements that we will continue to work hard to make EPS College shine bright in the days to come with the enduring support of the Ministry of Education, the PSSA and the Bureau of Education Committee. Today I also wish to salute the relentless work of all our distinguished members of the Parents Teachers Association for the betterment of the living and learning conditions of the school. May I avail of this opportunity to express on behalf of the school community our heartfelt gratitude to all members of the PPA, your unconditional support towards this college cannot be quantified and our collaboration in the past year has engendered positive results. I salute your labour of love towards the college community. In conclusion, I wish to thank all staff members of BPS College who work to make these successes a reality. I also wish to thank our manager, Madame Va, the Deputy Director, Mrs. Dorak, for their support. And also all my warmest thanks and appreciation go to my staff who work to make this event a success. Thank you very much for your kind attention.